For the base pages of the album, we're going to make three page sets. So you need to cut, for your base, you need to cut three that are seven inch by nine. And you're going to put the seven inch on all three sets, three of these base pages. You can put seven inches at the top and score at a half inch. I'm going to show you how to put one page set, base page set together, and then you will make two more on your own. So then you also need to cut for your page pocket sleeves. You need three that are six and a half by ten. And you put the ten inch at the top. You're going to score it a half inch. Turn it. Score it half inch. Checking this, score it half inch on this side. Okay, so move your bone scoreboard out of the way and go ahead and take your bone folder, fold and burnish the hinges on your page pocket sleeves on each end. You should have a half inch hinge on each end and they need to be going folded towards each other like this. Okay, take your page and fold and burnish that half inch hinge. Now I use the artisan cardstock which is a very um, good quality linen cardstock and I've never had any problems with making my hinges this way. If you're uncomfortable with that or if your score uh, cardstock seems to be cracking, you can put a very narrow uh, scotch tape, gift wrap tape, and I use you would use the mat right along that fold line and refold it to give it some extra strength. But I make mine without the tape. Take your base page, that you folded the hinge, you're going to do the same on all three. Fold it back so that you have the fold here on your left, and you're going to take your pocket page sleeve and you're going to glue this on to the front of the page. So take your glue and let's work on one side, one hinge at a time. So with the hinge folded down, put your glue here. This is so the hinge is on the inside and you have a fold line there. Line it up to the outer edge, the outer corner right here. And then all the way across the bottom so that it's nice and straight and burnish that. And you can go ahead and open it up and burnish it on the inside here. Then turn it, put glue on the back on the hinge here so that it's folded towards the inside. Like this. Fold it and bring it to the edge here at the bottom. So you want to line it up here on the cut edge. The fold, the hinge is right here. So line it up here all the way across. Nice and straight and burnish. And you can burnish down inside if you can reach inside with your bone folder. Have an opening here, an opening here by the hinge. So on the hinge side, open up your hinge Place a line of glue underneath this sleeve page right along the inside part of the fold line, not on the hinge part, and then seal this up with glue. I like to use glue to seal these pockets and sleeves up because it dries. It's not sticky after it dries. Score tape or any kind of ta uh, ATG tape will stay sticky and so whatever you put inside can stick to the inside. So now we have our pocket here on the side and this is one of our pages. So we have three base pages, I already have two already made, that are ready for us to assemble different flaps and pockets and get them ready for the book.